Hello and a warm welcome on what is a glorious night for football. Perfect playing conditions. My name is Derek Ray. And sitting alongside me, ready to provide all the analysis, is Stuart Robson. And with the atmosphere really building up nicely, we should be in for a terrific contest. It's Norway versus France. Thanks, Derek. Well, often we talk about the tactics, the individual players, players that are missing, but so often it's the mentality of the players that is key to winning any football game. Which of these teams has the right attitude today is the big question. A chance for them to provide a test in the form of a corner. Now sending it in. And the danger's still on. Chouameni. Dembele on the ball. Aurelien Chouameni. He has teammates around him. Well, nothing productive, really. Well, not many would debate the point that Erling Haaland is a joy to watch whenever he's Derek, out. this could be a goal here. Now, was that the denial of a clear goal-scoring opportunity? And a red card it is. Denial of a clear goal-scoring opportunity. Well, as soon as he made the tackle, he knew the outcome. That's an easy decision for the referee. Berger. Ball's gone. Holland. Well, showing excellent judgment to intercept. Martin Odegaard. This is looking threatening, but really sticking to the task defensively. Can he find the right pass? Well, a good tackle. Kunde. He's given it straight to the opposition. Martin Odegaard. Promising attack, this. Spectacular save, top-class goalkeeping. Dembele. Disappointing for France to give it away like that. Morten Torsby. It's with Erdogan. Teammates available. Must score! Really good diving save. Trying to pick out a teammate. So a goal kick is what's coming up here. Griezmann. Tempele. And Norway with the ball again. Giroud. And here's Dembele. To jump in front. And saved by the keeper. And over comes the corner. Well cleared away over the byline and a corner kick to come. Well, a bit short with the clearance. Intercepting it intelligently. Well, the counter chance looks very real.
unable to keep the ball that time. Alexander Surlot. Plenty of forward momentum here, but can they produce? Holland. Running with the ball confidently. Well, they've won possession back. What can they do from here? Martin Odegaard. Plenty of support here. And he's broken free. Surely. And a goal. Now they've broken through. 1 0 here. Well, just look at his movement. He knows exactly how to find space. And it's also a tidy finish. That's a nice goal. So France get the ball rolling once more. We're about to find out how they're going to react to the setback. Very quick thinking there. Martin Odegaard. Promising looking attack. Holland, the supporters want to see him have a go. Well, France have controlled possession, as you can see, but they've shown a real lack of creativity today. They need to be far more inventive in the final third if they're to turn things around here. No doubt, they go to work moving it around again. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Racing forward, trying to catch them out. Holland. Now, denial of a clear goal-scoring opportunity, maybe. Will she produce the red card here? And it is an early shower for him. Red card. Well, the outcome was never in doubt. That was always going to be a sending off. Well, he took care of it defensively. Well, in terms of added time, a minimum of one minute. Rabio, Giroud. And so it is, the first half story. And back underway with France looking to find a route back into this game. Well, a case of being clean through. Now, will she produce the red card? And it was always going to be crystal clear for the referee in terms of the decision. Well, he had to make a tackle, didn't he? Unfortunately, it wasn't a good one. Firing it towards goal! Well, it looked as though it had a chance of going in. Well, he should make the keeper work there, but you sense a goal is coming. Really good high press. And that is the sort of tackle he had scripted in his mind. Well, let's see what they have in store for them on the break. Will it be sufficiently imaginative? All in all, a broken counter-attack. Holland. Well, that's been deemed offside, and maybe, Stuart, we could accuse him of being rather greedy. Yeah, that's sloppy play. All he had to do was let the ball run through to his teammate there. Throw in for France coming up. Chouameni. Now Giroud. A very good tackle. And there the move will end, because it's offside. Close, though. Yeah. 
Giroud. Nicely timed tackle. Could be a chance to break here. El Yunusi. Erling Haaland. And a goal to really bolster things for them. Two in front. Well, as you can see, his movement is really good, which then makes the finish look easy. That's a decent goal, that's for sure. So, 2-0 now. Torsby. Well, the stats show us that the hosts haven't had that much of the ball, but that won't bother them because when they win it in deep areas, They've got forward with pace and with numbers. It's been a great counter-attacking display. And the penalty has been given here. Well, there might have been a case for a yellow card, but the referee didn't see it that way. Well, Derek, it's a foul, yes. A penalty, absolutely. But for me, it's not a yellow card. The ref has got that right. And in it goes, as coolly as you like. Never in any doubt from the spot. Well, as you can see, the keeper just stands still and the ball's hit down the side of him. It's a strange one in the end. Three goals without reply. He goes short. Mbappe. Textbook defending inside the box. And you don't want to lose possession there. It's there for him. And fine goalkeeping. Whipped in by Griezmann. And he's dispatched the header. Well, here it is again. It's a well-delivered ball into the box. And then what a great finish as well. Good connection with the ball, leaving the keeper with little chance. It's a great goal. So they get the ball moving again. 3-1 the scoreline here. What's going to happen next? And in with a real chance. Well, he went for power, but he might be having second thoughts about that now. Yeah, all power and no accuracy. That's a poor finish. Well, they'll be happy to have regained possession. Holland. Hold on. And it goes. Well, it's one goal after another. A highly impressive performance. Well, let's have another look at this because Holland shows great skill to go beyond the defender. And then from there, the keeper has little chance. Two on one, left completely exposed, and it made for a simple finish in the end. Well, not too much defending going on in the grand scheme of things. 4-1. Teammates available. And it might be. Oh, must be. A goal! How about that? He's put it away to make it a hat-trick. Well, here's the replay, and it's a simple finish in the end. But where was the defending? That's just not good enough. A glut of goals. 5-1 it is.
Very quick thinking there. Turam. This might be ideal for the counter. And offside anyway, albeit a tight one. Getting forward. Chouameni. Well, they pulled one back, but perhaps a bit too late in this contest. They haven't been at the races this evening. Well, here you can see it again. Good run, great strength, and a composed finish under pressure. That's a top-class goal. Ten minutes to go. France doing well to regain possession. And Norway will get the throw in. Frederik Aursnes. Now options are plenty. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. Counter-attacking very much an option. He's in behind. And there it is, a goal. But will it be purely a consolation at this stage of the proceedings? They haven't been at the best. Well, let's see this again. This is counter-attacking football at its very best. And once he gets onto it, he just smashes it past the keeper with great technique. What an emphatic finish that is. Not a scoreline we see all that often. 5-3. King. Well, offside, I rather think he was caught in two minds. Well, he just needed to go elsewhere with his pass. He showed a complete lack of awareness there. Griezmann. Tuham. Well, time just challenged magnificently. King. Well, couldn't bend his run, and the flag went up. The electronic board has been held in the air and we're going to have a minimum of four added minutes. No foul play, says the referee. Well, the supporters think it's on. Who can he pick out? El Yanusi. And King! Can they keep it out? And second time around, he scores! But the keeper left to wonder what his defenders were doing. Well, here it is again, and the striker does everything right. He hits it across the goalkeeper, which makes it difficult for him. And then the player coming in is alert for the rebound. What a good goal that is. And there it is, the final whistle. And the fans will be...